Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we also have a new version upgrade to the Brave Web Browser, if you do use the Brave Web Browser on desktop, which also started rolling out on the 21st of June 2022, which was yesterday in my region. Now this latest release takes the version to 1.40, and also the browser has been upgraded to the latest Chromium version, which is version 103, and that's because, as many of you know, the browser is based on the open source Chromium platform. Now there's not much in the way of new features in version 1.40, so don't expect any major feature updates. And once again, like most of the recent upgrades and updates to the browser, the Brave team has focused a lot of their attention in updating and fixing and improving the Brave wallet. And there are too many improvements and fixes to mention in this video so for the wallet, so I thought I'd just take a couple of the general uh, improvements and fixes and just mention them for you today. Now, regarding the wallet, um, they've added Filecoin to the Brave wallet, and then there are also two fixes for the wallet. The first is that some extensions were uh, bypassing um, the Brave wallet as the default wallet uh, in the browser, so that has been fixed and is no more, so that's been addressed where the Brave wallet now is not bypassed by certain extensions as the default wallet. And then there was also an issue uh, where uh, users uh, were required to press a tab multiple times to navigate from the password field to the confirm password field via and using the Brave wallet, and that has also been addressed and fixed. And then there's one or two fixes and improvements regarding Brave Sync and the Sync chain. Now, as many of you know who do use the browser, uh, the browser does not require a username and password to sync uh, the browser uh, between and across your different devices. It uses a sync chain. And the first uh, fix there or improvement is that they've updated the QR sync code generator to include the Brave icon when creating new QR sync code. So that's a little visual improvement to the browser. And then the sync chain was unable to copy the sync code from, existi from the existing sync chain in certain cases. So um, that bug fix and that fix has been addressed now with this latest bug fix. So that should improve the syncing, as mentioned, from for the Brave browser across your different devices after this update. And then there's just a little minor um, upgrade to the Brave Rewards icon in the top right of the toolbar. So if you click on that, you can now right click on that. You can now hide the Brave Rewards icon by right clicking instead of having to go to the settings and toggle that off in the settings. So that's a little improvement there. Now, if you'd like to see if you have the latest version, as always, we head to the menu in the top right about Brave. And as I do mention um, quite frequently, the Brave web browser I find is very good at upgrading and updating itself in the background compared to the other web browsers. And um, um, the latest version after the browser has been updated now is 1.40.105. And the latest Chromium version is 103.0.5060.53. And that's exactly the same Chrome version now as the Google Chrome web browser. And to get to the, re the, to the release notes, we just click on the version. And as I say and have mentioned, there are numerous improvements to the Brave uh, wallet. And um, you can, if you want to find out more about that, you can just click on the version and come to the release notes. And then just to mention that upgrade to Chromium 103.5060.53. Now, the Chromium uh, platform, which the browser is based on, has also received a couple of bug fixes in the Chromium log. So just double check your browsers up to date if you have experienced any issues, as those could address uh, the, the Chromium engine in the browser if, if it had any issues. And also, which um, is quite an important side of this update, is that uh, the Chromium uh, version has received and includes 14 security fixes, the same as Google Chrome. And out of those 14 security fixes, um, one of those is critical, which is your highest rated vulnerability, which is used after free. And then you've got two high risk vulnerabilities, which are your second highest ranked vulnerabilities. And once again, one of those is use after free and another is type confusion in the V8 JavaScript engine. And use after free and type confusion in V8 um, as I do mentioned in a lot of the Chromium browser videos, is a very common exploit that the Chromium team um, uh, is patching on a regular basis with these security updates. So just double check you're up to date. Uh, even if you're not interested in any little improvements or add-ons, just double check your browser's up to date as it will address um, those 14 security issues in the Chromium uh, uh, 
project and platform and also um, as mentioned that patches one critical and two high risk vulnerabilities so that's more or less what's new in version 1.40 of the brave web browser for desktop so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one